Good afternoon, everyone. Just want to invite you to an open house. The weather's a little crazy today, so we're going to go ahead and do a virtual open house. I'll post it up to YouTube so you guys can watch it and view it at any time. I, for, I apologize for the weather being as rough as it was. Uh, we did plan. We put it in newspaper, hope for everybody to get out here. And it was just a little crazy. But sorry about that. But hey, let's just get you inside and get you to take a walk around. All right, let's get you to the entryway right here. I did put down a little towel to make sure we didn't get anything wet inside. Front entryway, kitchen windows. All right, I'm gonna get you guys inside. First thing I'm gonna do here, close the door and take you to the left. As we enter the left way here, we have the office. Um, do a little walk in here and I'll come to the corner here and give you a turn um, this could be a third bedroom um, all you'd have to do is add a closet right over there in that corner probably uh, but currently it's just listed as an office that was a TV on the wall there um, the home does need a little bit of updates uh, the seller does understand and, and kind of feels you know hey let, let the buyer pick the updates like for instance you're going to want to put in new flooring she understands that. And a good paint, you know. All the uh, nail holes have been patched. So all you'd have to do is go through and give it a nice paint job. All right. Get you out the door here to the guest bath. All right. So again, you may want to consider going with the tile. It has linoleum in it now. Good looking shower, nice tall ceiling. Clean commode. Sink there with a mirror. Okay. So if you wanted to do a few updates, I'm sure that the styles and things you would pick, you'd want to make your own. Okay. And I'll back out of there. All right. And here in the hallway, we have a linen closet. I'll open that guy up for you. Give you a view of the space that it has. Okay. All right. Then we have the spare bedroom here. Spin around there, and then I'll walk across the room and go the other way. This room has one of the best carpets in it. Um, again, it was a guest room. Not a lot of people use the lies this room. This one does have a closet right there. Okay. Let's get you back out here. All right. Turn to the left here. This is the entryway again coming in. To the left here would be your living room, living area. Okay. To the right here would be your dining area. I'm going to step over this way and give you a view all the way across the room. And that looks into the kitchen there. Um, out the back, you just have a very plain lanai. Um, really open to whatever you want to do with it. Not enough room to put a pool, but in the villages, you know, it's not one of the most... Um, things you have to do because there's so many community pools with activities that you don't really really have to do that it's more important just have great living space and great neighbors so home also offers a brand new roof just installed all right i'm gonna swing here and this goes to the master little hallway here 
Okay. Walk straight through. Turn here. Let you guys get a full feel for the length or the width of the room. All right. Little spot up there for putting some sort of tchotchkes or knickknacks. Then we have a hallway here that goes into the master bath. Walk-in closet. Okay. Back up to around here. You have a second walk-in closet here. Lots and lots of storage space there, guys. All right, then around here, gonna take a good spin this way. And you have a nice corner here, double sink, big, big mirrors. Okay. All right, then I'm gonna flip around this way and show you that you have another linen closet in the master, double size there. And then here you have a separate uh, water closet with the shower, the pocket door. Okay. Still a good size. Okay. You have a nice little seat in there. Okay. Step back here. Oh, I didn't show you underneath the two counters here. Let me show you those. I like to show those, that way you can see if things have been leaking or in disrepair, but there doesn't appear to be any evidence at all. Well maintained. Okay. The other one opened up here for you. Same thing, maintained, good shape. Okay. All right, I'm gonna take you back out this way then, guys. And we're gonna go this way into the laundry room. Home does come with a washer and dryer. And space here for extra cabinet if you wanted it. Okay, you do come with two built-in cabinets there. All right, then we're gonna come out here to the garage. See if I can get the lights on. There we go. Nice double garage, and then on top of that, there is extra space over there against the wall for a uh, golf cart garage. It does need to be painted out here. Um, this part probably wasn't maintained as well as the rest of the house. A good scrubbing of the uh, concrete and paint out here would make it look a lot better. Um, AC is in pretty good condition. It is original, uh, but it is working just fine. It's been maintained. Um, hot water tank also original, but has been maintained. Both are working in really good shape. Okay. All right, guys, let's take you in here. Turn those lights back off. All right, let's we'll spin around here and take you over here to the kitchen. And then here in the kitchen, we have a nice uh, big counter space just all over the place there. And it has an also with an eat-in area in the kitchen. Okay. It is a gas stove. Really clean and really good condition. Lots and lots of counter space. Refrigerator is almost like new. 
It is a different style, different color though, so that may not work for everybody. But again, it's all up to every person's personal taste. Look underneath the counter here. Again, no evidence of leak or damage, anything at all. Really good shape. And you can look down into the sink and see how nice and clean it is. All right, guys, I think that I have given you the full tour of the home. I'm gonna Listen, guys, we are in the villages. We're in the village of Briar Meadow, which is just off of Highway 42. Come check out the house. It's 8391 Southeast 168th Trinity Place. Great, great location in the villages. Great home. Bond is paid. It's really, really nice. And I'd love to get you outside, guys, but that weather is not pretty. So, hey, wait till our next house. We'll see you soon. Thanks.